wanna know his secret? What's up guys welcome to your weekly tutorial my name is Grenader and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make lower thirds or animated banners as a lot of people like to call them so uh, just sit tight and I'll be taking you through the steps and hopefully you guys have an amazing time following along we'll be using Sony Vegas Pro 12 instead of After Effects CS6 so Hold on to your seatbelt and let's take this ride. So step one would be to download the freaking template guys, download the template. Now step two would be to actually open the template, luckily for you I already have it up here, up and ready to go. Alright guys, step three would be to change this orange color to a greener color because um, I have no idea why I chose brown but since uh, the Instagram thing is kind of brownish and the uh, uh, Google Plus thing is kind of brownish. It really does not work with that So what we're gonna do is that we're gonna come down here and click on this little button right here on the side and this will allow us to um, Just play around with the settings. So click on this little Rectangular generated media thing and then it should pop up with a little window instead of orange make sure to click it on uh, Green if you don't want to do that just click the color itself and you can just you know drag it over until it's green so after that, you want to hit the X and move on to step four, maybe, I think. Okay, guys, moving on to step four or five or six or seven or eight. Um, I'm going to be showing you guys how to actually just change the text. So it's pretty damn easy. Um, it's already over here, opened already for you. I don't know. Okay, it's already open for you, so you don't really have to do much. Um, all you got to do is just uh, start wherever you want to start. So let's start with Facebook. Click on the little rectangular thing, and then it, where it says Grenader, change that to whatever you want. So, John C. John C is going to be my name, so I'm going to hit X, and then it should update with John Z. And then you want to switch over to Google Plus, whatever you Google Plus, your Google Plus may be, change it to that. So, John Z. Oh, come on, man. Why am I drawing things on the freaking screen? Stop. Okay, John Z, and hit X, and then continue doing exactly what I'm doing. Alrighty guys, now that you're done with that, you can move on to step 5, 6, 7, or 8. Alrighty guys, so on step 6, 7, or 8, you want to hit the render as button because this will allow you to render it into an actual clip, and then all you gotta do is... Is just save it yo so after that you want to change it to whatever you want to name it I'm gonna name it social media 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 come on media quit doing that media why isn't it's freaking D all right it's, it's gonna be called social me for now because Camtasia is really dumb right now so after that you want to hit browse you want to save wherever you want to save I'm gonna save on my desktop because it's just easier to find and after that, you want to click on either 30 frames per second or 60 frames per second. If you don't have these already by now, make sure to create a template. Or what you can do is to go into show, um, click off of that where it says show favorites only. And it should show you all these presets. Um, the one I'd recommend to start off on would be the internet um, HD 1080p. If that's not there... I think I made that, but if that's not there, make sure to hit Internet HD 1080p or Internet HD 720p. However, I have already made a template, so you just have to hit YouTube 30 frames per second. That is my phone, but we're going to ignore it for a second, and we're going to hit render. Oh my god. It's over. Oh, dang it. Hey cutie. Hi. What are you doing outside? You faggot. I'm eating with my cousin. She came over. Alrighty guys, step 10, 12, and 11. If uh, I, I really don't know what step we're on. So hopefully I know what step we're on. So 
Uh, we're on the step where we're done rendering and here's how it looks like and it should be green it should have a green background so let's take a quick look at this little thing and so here it is it's um you know it's very beautiful it just slides in and out and the background is green and it's pretty awesome so you might be wondering how you take away the greenness and that is made with a color keyer so i'm going to show you guys exactly how to do that so we're going to open up a brand new file in uh, sony vegas and um we're just going to open it just like it is and then we're going to a port just mm, random gameplay um i don't even know if i have random gameplay anymore i think i threw it away hang on recycling bin um, 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 um uh, no where's my gameplay uh anyways okay we don't need gameplay what we're gonna do is that i'm going to import a picture um here's this uh I don't know this grenader picture right here and it just says grenader on it and um, we're going to import our thing we just made in our desktop I called it social me and it's, what should it be um, let me refresh and there it is social me so I'm gonna drag that onto your timeline hit yes um, or if you're recording at 60 frames per second don't hit yes but if you aren't, then just hit yes. And this should be on top of your gameplay. So let's pretend this picture here is my gameplay. And you want to put this on top of it. That way it'll show up. So uh, it's kind of green-ish and kind of nasty-ish. So we're going to take that away. Now, a, a, a little quick tip, um, just in case for those of you that don't have a Facebook or whatever. Uh, fill it out anyways. And then just find the part where the Facebook thing goes away. And then just trim it like so. And then after that, you're going to get the Google Plus. And then after that, it just disappears. And you can split this into four different um, timeline things and just play with the actual settings or whatever. So um, I'm just going to leave it to how it was before. And um, we're just going to leave it like that. So um, what you want to do is go to Video Effects, go down to Color Keyer. And I already have a preset for um, my Twitter, Instagram, all that stuff. So. Um, what I'm going to do is uh, do default and drag that onto that and I'm gonna make sure to hit the um, Green I think there's a yeah green screen preset and it should do that now um, If we play with the settings a little bit we can fix the threshold To where it's actually transparent, but it's not like this So if you see this your gameplay would probably be a bit darker so you want to lighten up the threshold or low threshold, uh, lighten it up to where it's um, not interfering with the actual gameplay, but at the same time, it's not like completely transparent. So um, I find to be just a little bit like right there would be fine. 0.163. It all depends on your gameplay and what you have behind it. And uh, you can do a little test, check all these uh, social media and some of them might not work like the Facebook one. Um, it might require a bit more or less threshold so that's when you need to just uh, split it and uh, go over here click on the little like nutsack looking thing and then uh, make sure to lower the th or actually bump up the threshold and then lower down the high threshold like that and now there you go guys there you go you just it's just a matter of playing with the settings um, each individual um, like little animation here is different this one is brown this one is blue this one is orange reddish kind of thing and this one is blue so um, I just you know split them all up and then individually fine-tune every single one of them copy and paste and you know do all that stuff so uh, that's pretty much it guys thank you for watching if you enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like and a thumbs up wait that's the same thing okay Anyways, leave a comment down below, like this video if you like it, uh, leave a comment down below with uh, your suggestion on what I should do next, um, and that's pretty much it guys, thank you for watching, you guys have a great day, see you in the next video, peace.